The city of Fresno is one of the top five largest cities within California, uh, with a population of about 500,000 individuals. It's very unique in the way that it's known for uh, serving about three-fourths of our world for its agriculture services. But we see historically that certain parts of our city have been deprived of certain uh, basic needs. Systematically and historically, due to things like uh, redlining, has caused areas within our community, such as Southwest Fresno, to be known for one of the top five cities uh, for concentrated poverty. Uh, last year, we've seen the most homicides and the most shootings within our city. Advanced Peace is a community building program that focuses on investing time, energy, resources, and really focuses on building relationship with the individuals that make up the community in order to see the well-being, the development, and the health of our community. Advanced Peace altogether is a gun reduction strategy um, that finds alternatives for uh, potential shooters that's in high risk areas. Um, we actually going in and talking with these individuals. We're actually engaging with them. We're trying to figure out, you know, what's the altercations, what's the problems. Most of these individuals we know, 90% of the individuals that we deal with, they, they want change. They want change, they just don't have the outlets. To me, Advanced Peace is guys that came from the street that are trying to better the communities. Um, I think oftentimes there's people from the outside trying to tell people uh, from the streets how to live their lives, how to fix things, and they've never walked a day in their footsteps. So this group has people that have lived that life and have got out of that life or, or are starting to get out of that life, and they're trying to make a difference. Okay, so we got three different locations yes, with three sir. different types of food. Yes, okay, sir. do we have three different dates? We employ community members that know community members. We service the needs of the community. And it starts really with basic needs, uh, whether that be uh, job training, whether that be uh, social emotional, whether that be having someone they can call or just have someone that they know they can trust. And that's what we're here to do. And as we continue to invest into the individuals in our community, as we continue to attack the roots, of the symptom of gun violence, we believe we'll see that uh, decrease tremendously. I've been doing gang intervention, prevention, and reintegration work in Fresno for about 16 years now. So after working with young people, I learned that they realized that they had a lot of potential and a lot of power that wasn't being tapped into. So the Peacemakers Fellowship which, uh, was a fellowship designed to engage impacted young people and help them imagine programs and pathways forward um, that can improve their lives and the lives of the community members around them. So currently Advanced Peace is in this stage where it can um, invest and develop other leaders such as myself in a, a, a system that's supported by you know, city funds and um, foundation funds so that we can deploy more peacemakers. So when we say deployment, we're speaking about a model of understanding impacted young people or in, and impacted youth, impacted community members as agents of change as opposed to objects of change. That we don't want to come to people and um, overlord and change them. We want to give them the power to change themselves and to change the community around them. So when we say deploy, we're talking about equipping people, developing people, and then deploying them to be that change that, um, that, that they need to be for their community. We got some boxes, man. It's got some good stuff in here. We go out through all the, go out through all the neighborhoods. You know, what motivated me was, you know, I was one of the lucky ones that made it out. You know, I came from drugs, violence, uh, abuse, food stamps, uh, poverty, and was able to make it out. You know, so the one thing I, you know, I, I wanted to make sure I did was to give back. So anything, any kind of business I'm involved in uh, post-career has to have a give back component. Um, and obviously Advanced Peace is probably the biggest give back component I'm a, I'm a part of. To me, the Advanced Peace success would look like these individuals that we're working with, we see in them like 10 years from now, their well-being's changed, their whole dynamic, their whole demeanor. Um, they, they learned about LLCs, they learned how to start businesses. And ultimately success would be that one of them would take over our position and still have that same passion and keep it going and keep elevating. A, a real power of Advanced Peace is that it's, it's designed at its core to reduce gun violence. And, and in Fresno, um, every homicide costs us, costs us city a million dollars um, and every shooting costs the city seven hundred fifty thousand dollars so by working with young people to reimagine their, their community we're saving dollars dollars that can be reallocated and reinvested in parks in schools in programming in, in, in apparatuses that actually improve the lives of communities which will sustain our gun violence reduction over a long period of time and just improve the whole holistic quality of health of people in these areas for us to see our community not not as a, a community 
with a dark cloud, but a community with bright, um, self-sufficient, uh, prosperous individuals. And it may not look like the community next door, but we see our community as assets. We believe as we continue to, to touch on some of those systemic root issues and continue to invest relationally with our with individuals, we'll see we'll see growth. I mean, you'll see you'll see gun violence, the act of gun violence uh, dropping, um, and we believe that. We believe as 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 people receive love, things change. So we that's how we approach our community with love.